parking tickets in my day. What you need to know about me is I'm a very regular American, just like the people I represent in my district and most people across the country. In fact, I wasn't a political person until I found a candidate that I really liked, and his name is Donald J. Trump when he ran for president. And then I started seeing things in the news that didn't make sense to me, like Russian collusion, which are conspiracy theories also, and have been proven so. These things bothered me deeply, and I realized just watching CNN or Fox News, I may not find the truth. And so what I did is I started looking up things on the internet, asking questions like most people do every day. Use Google. And I stumbled across something, and this was at the end of 2017, called QAnon. The problem with that is, though, is I was allowed to believe things that weren't true, and I would ask questions, questions about them and talk about them. And that is absolutely what I regret. Because if it weren't for the Facebook post and, and comments that I liked in 2018, I wouldn't be standing here today and you couldn't point a finger and accuse me of anything wrong. You see, school shootings are absolutely real. And every child that has lost, those families mourn it. I also want to tell you 9-11 absolutely happened. I remember that day crying all day long watching it on the news. And it's a tragedy for anyone to say it didn't happen. And so that I definitely want to tell you, I do not believe that it's fake. I also want to tell